the Fort McMurray First Nation is rightly distancing itself from the Jane Fonda traveling kook road show. You see Fonda has been in Alberta this week to malign and lie about Alberta's responsible oil sands development to anyone who will listen to her. So Chief Executive Officer of Fort McMurray First Nation, Barry Callahoo, released a statement. Now they were prompted to do this because one of their band's former counselors, someone named Cleo Desjardins, was part of Jane Fonda's seditious Blame Canada tour of our oil sands. Now Desjardins can be seen in this video with Jane Fonda right before Métis advocate for the oil sands and Fort McMurrayite, Robbie Picard, came along and dropped some facts on all of them. It's awesome, just watch. Are you aware that Jim Boucher from the Fort Mackay First Nations just invented $250 million into the oil sands? Are you aware that there's there's 289 Aboriginal businesses? We actually don't have time because that's actually where we're going to Fort Mackay. So yeah. could you please stop no. interrupting a CBC interview? No, quit kind of hijack we're the entire thing. I know who you are. You're not telling the whole story about Aboriginally owned businesses. You that's never have. That's that there's Aboriginal owned businesses, but that doesn't mean that you, you get to tell the story. You don't speak for all the Aboriginal of businesses. Of course I don't. So this is the statement Fort McMurray First Nation just released. It reads, Fort McMurray First Nation played no part in planning, facilitating, or participating in the Jane Fonda visit. It is our understanding that the former Fort McMurray First Nation counselor was representing keepers of the water in her meeting with Ms. Fonda. She was not representing Fort McMurray First Nation, and our nation does not endorse the Fonda visit. Fort McMurray First Nation does support responsible development of the oil sands and is confident that our industry partners have the same vision. We have strong partnerships with many companies and we are grateful to these partners for the significant role they have played in our efforts since 2011 to establish Fort McMurray First Nation as a strong, economically self-sufficient First Nation. Well, it would appear that Jane Fonda isn't the Aboriginal advocate she thinks she is. She didn't bother to ask what the Fort McMurray First Nation thought before she flew in on a plane and bashed the jobs their people do every single day. This rich, white, American liberal doesn't speak for them. For the Rebel.media, I'm Sheila Gunn-Reed. To never miss the other side of the story, click the link below to subscribe today.